We have seen the universe's quiet beginnings and its deepest darkness. Now, we witness its primal rage. Orbiting a star 560 light years away is a world that has failed to cool. A terrestrial sphere forever trapped in a state of molten chaos. This is Kepler 10b, a rocky super Earth. 1.4 times the size of our own planet. But unlike Earth, Kepler 10b orbits its star in less than 20 hours. 20 times closer than Mercury is to the Sunday. The gravitational and thermal forces here are overwhelming. Kepler 10b is tidally locked, resulting in one side always facing its star. This tidal locking creates extreme temperature differences between the two sides. The surface temperature on the day side exceeds 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. Such extreme heat is sufficient to vaporize silicate materials. The day side maintains a constant state of molten rock due to the intense heat. Kepler 10b's atmosphere is characterized by a high concentration of vaporized rock. This phenomenon is due to the planet's proximity to its star and intense stellar wind. The lava surface continuously emits vaporized rock into the atmosphere. As the vapor rises, it cools and condenses, resulting in molten rock rain. This cycle of vaporization and remelting creates a unique atmospheric condition on Kepler 10b. The terminator line is the division between a celestial body's illuminated and dark hemispheres. It represents the transition zone from day to night on a planet or moon. On Kepler 10b, this line showcases a dramatic contrast in surface conditions. The day side exhibits glowing magma due to intense heat and tidal forces. Conversely, the night side features dark, solidified rock, a result of rapid cooling. The Terminator line visually emphasizes the extreme temperature gradient across Kepler 10b's surface. Kepler 10b's night side always faces away from its star, resulting in significantly lower temperatures. These cooler temperatures allow molten rock to solidify, forming jagged planes across the night side. Powerful winds, generated by the heat differential, transport molten lava from the day side. This influx of material influences the night side's geology, creating unique formations and compositions. Follow for more space documentaries.